I'm so slow. <laughs> the goal is to build a standard size weasel that weighs less than 100 grams. Start off by hot wiring a weasel wing from a light grade um, expanded polystyrene EPS. From that we cut the elevons and then we cut a bevel into the wing rather than the elevons just to make sure that the elevons retain as much material as possible. They're already flimsy. Then we use clear packing tape to create a hinge for the elevons. The control rods are garden wire and heat shrink tube that we glued and shrunk onto a one millimeter carbon fiber spar. And the servos are 3.7 gram servos. We got another bit of tape on the leading edge, but there's no tape on the bottom or on the top of the wing. To get the CD right, while staying below 100 grams, we stick the lipo on a carbon fiber rod. The lipo is attached with Velcro and rubber bands. The fin is a one millimeter balsa with a bit of tape and it has tabs that slot into the, um, the wing. Oh, that works. But gotta keep the nose into the wind. I need lots and lots of aileron to initiate the turn. Once you got it going, it's not too hard. Keep the nose down, otherwise I lose my speed. Huh. It works. That's remarkable. And these dunes are more than enough to keep this thing up. <laughs> I like it. And as with every other model, you get the hang of it after a while. <laughs> Whoop. And we're back in the lift. Ish. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Uh, she can't. Oh, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Come on, where's my wind? <laughs> ooh, ooh. Whoa, that was close.